A business owner is without a vital part of his livelihood after his food truck was stolen. Yeah, we talked with the owner about what this means for his business, what it's going to cost to replace it right before the holidays. Oh, my goodness. Crown Forest Amanda Harry has the story. The Grinch is out there, as we see. What was supposed to be a day of giving turned into a loss for Touch of Soul owner Eric Scott. Scott has a storefront in Emeryville and a food truck. He parks the truck in Oakland. When he went to get it Sunday morning, it was gone. It's crazy that um, you could put so much, so much time and so many hours in working to um, get something that you dreamed about and somebody could come take it in six seconds. So it was like, it was, it was devastating. There's surveillance video of the food trailer driving out of the parking lot. You can see the suspect's white truck pulling it. Scott says someone spotted it on I-5 near Merced heading south. He says he was about to get the truck ready for a Christmas Eve event. Actually, we give out food to the homeless. Um, we go to various sites and just um, pull the truck up and um, just feed the homeless. Scott says he wants to reschedule the event and continue helping those in need. But first, he needs to replace the truck. I'm trying to raise 80000 The truck costs about 80000 just about. So it's like, you know, just trying to get what I put back into it or something. Uh, maybe just have to start a little smaller than the truck that I had. He says in the meantime, he's trying to stay positive and enjoy the holidays. Well, continue to do what I do, you know and spread love and give love and continue to push forward. Well, that was Amanda Harry reporting. Now, Scott did file a police report with Oakland police. He's still holding some hope the truck might be found because it's clearly marked with his company logo.